Hi guys, this is Des, and welcome back. Today I'm going to be talking to you a little bit about my hair, my natural hair, and some detanglers that I use to detangle my hair before I wash. And um, that was one of the questions that I, I get a lot. Do I detangle before I wash? And my answer is yes, I do. I do detangle my hair before I wash. I actually use detangling products, spray in my hair. It help, helps me to section off my hair, and then I begin to detangle my hair in the process that you guys know that I detangle in, starting from the ends and working up to the roots with a wide tooth comb. And uh, so I want to share with you a couple of products, but I'm going to also vlog a little bit about the natural hair journey and what it really means to me and what it might mean to you. So before I do that, I'm going to talk about uh, a couple of detanglers and the first one is by Silk Elements and this is called Silken Child. And these bottles, guys, these bottles are virtually empty because I use these products. Now I know you're probably thinking you, you actually spray your hair with your product and then wash it down the drain. Yeah, 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 I, I do that because I want to reduce the amount of hair loss so I don't wash my hair down the drain. So this is uh, by Silken, this is called Silken Child and it's a leave-in detangler. And it's cute because at the bottom it says don't be naughty. And um, this product works really well. And the three products that I'm going to show you, they work really well and I don't differentiate between the three of them. I just grab whatever I can grab in my hand, detangle, and then I wash. Or if I'm going to braid my hair up beyond this state, I'm going to detangle it again and then rebraid it up and maybe wear a ponytail or one of my uh, curly wigs. So um, this is again by Silk Elements. And you've seen this in the beauty supply stores, maybe in your drugstores, I'm not sure. Another detangler I use is by Soft, Soft Sheen Carlson. You guys have seen me use this many times. This is dark and lovely and it is called Beautiful Beginnings and this is for children's hair but it works really well on adult hair. It works really well on my hair and my hair tends to be very, not very, I'm sorry, tends to be a little coarse and it gets tangled very very quickly. This product works really well on my hair and so does this one. So does the Silken Child and this is also a product that's designed for children's hair also. They both work really, really well. Another detangler I use, and this is the third in this trio, and this is by Hairtrition, and I really like this a lot. Again, this works as well as the first two that I just showed you. But this is not designed for children. You can use it on a child's hair, but it's just a general product, and it's a color protectant. So when you use this, it helps to, if you color your hair or dye your hair, it helps to keep the color richness and it helps not to fade it out. So if you're interested in a product like that, you probably would be interested in this. And it definitely, again, is a leave-in detangler. And it detangles my tangly, tangly hair. My hair gets really tangled. It helps to just smooth out the hair so that I can do my detangling process. And again, when I do my detangling process, I'll spray these products or one of these three products in my hair all over. Then I'll part my hair down the center and then make part it again on the side, just creating like four sections. I'll pin each section up and I'll start to detangle and then I'll either braid it up or I'll reclip it back up and prepare for my wash. And you guys know how I wash my hair. You've seen my videos on that. And if you're interested in seeing that, I'll definitely provide a link in the um, information box below or the description box below. But this product, Hair Trition, has um, I get a lot of comments about this, or messages I should say, in my message center on, on this channel. Um, because I have a natural hair blog up on YouTube also, and I get a lot of responses and questions to things I've said there. I get the questions here at this, at this Desi Beauty Made Easy, and, um, and it's quite alright. I'll answer your questions wherever you leave them. But this product, it seems like it's causing problems for some people. Um, some of the qu questions I've got or the comments I've got was, this product really doesn't work at all. 
Now let me say something about this product. Everything that I use here at Beauty Made Easy with Desi, I use on my own hair. I never take it to a salonist and let them use it. I never t let my friend use it first and then use it on me. I use it myself. I, I use it on myself so that I can tell you guys about the texture, the feel, how the product felt in my hand. It's very important so that I can give you back that information to let you know what to expect and if you don't expect it then it may be because we have different sensory issues we have different sensory um, our fingers might be different the skin on our hands might be thicker or thinner so a product may feel differently in my hand than it does to 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 you or in your hand um, again I had got a message saying that this product doesn't work and all I can tell the person was the product didn't work for you it worked really well for me and that's all I can say and if you notice now I have disclaimers well as of I think December 2010 if I'm not mistaken or when, whenever it happened on YouTube we have to put disclaimers in all our videos but the thing about my disclaimers is that if a product is not going to work for me I'm not going to tell you otherwise so I felt really bad for the person and this person had this young woman had really thick, thick, coily hair, quite differently than my hair. Yes, my hair is thick, but it is not very coily. Um, it, it doesn't shrink very close to my hair, my head after I wash. You guys seen my hair when it's wet. It tends to be a little, a little wavy or very wavy. You've seen my as hair. As far as wet. my natural hair journey, guys, you have to realize we all have to realize that every one of us are on are on our own natural hair journey. I cannot walk in your footsteps, nor can you walk in mine. And so when we try products, when we're using products and we recommend products, that's all it can be is a recommendation. Um, so while you're on your natural hair journey, find out what products work best for you. I suggested before that we should keep journals as we use new products and continue to use old products, write down what we liked best about the product and if the product served our hair well. If it detangled well, if it got your hair clean, if it left your hair light and bouncy, or if it left your hair very dry and crunchy, you should write all this stuff down so that you can share that information with someone else, but at the same time letting them know that was your experiences with the product, not necessarily what they would experience if they tried the product and um so yeah this natural hair journey is is just that it's a journey and it's a personal journey and you need to look at it like that so when i share my journey with you keep in mind that it is just my journey i'm definitely testing product on my hair every few months to see if i can find something new that's going to work better than the stuff that i've liked from the months before and um I don't know. I'm just still I'm just still having a wonderful time. I am very pleased with the process of my hair. You guys, I'll put a picture up here to show you where I started from. I started with a big chop. I removed all the dead ends, the relaxed hair from my hair, and I think I had two inches of hair all over my head. And I started from this to this, and my hair has gotten long, so much longer in in that period of time. Um, from my big chop was in the fall of 2008 and now we are here 2011 and this is my hair length now I have had many trims in the interim so healthy hair is definitely I'm I feel like it's a work in progress you have to work every day to keep your hair healthy and to and to and, and just use the products that are going to work best for you and not that work best for me. So if you're watching this video and you've seen any three of these products and you've tried them and it didn't work for you, definitely video response to this video. We need to know that everything that each and every one of us try won't work for all of us. So with that said, I wish you all well on your natural hair journey. I wish you well in whatever you do in all endeavors of your life. And with that said, if you have any information about this video or you, that you want to share or any comments, definitely leave them below. And um, you take care and you be well. And I will see you very soon.
Bye-bye.